Okay, Sister Joellen from Casa Catalina, and we are ready for our 20th walk as a pantry. to all of you for coming out this morning. It's a great thing to see you on a beautiful sunny day because we know that the only way that we are going to end hunger in our community is making sure that we have a strong response to hunger today and tomorrow. Let's get this done! The fundraising portion of the walk is very important to us. We raise money through pledges, and that money is used throughout the year to pay our cost at the Greater Chicago Food Depository. I would say the cornerstone of our budget is this walk. It's crucial because the bulk of the food that we put out for these 400 families a week, we purchase. Thank you for walking. For those who need food, thank you. Thank you. The other thing about the walk is it's community outreach and it also allows our clients to participate. They can give back by actually participating in the walk because the food depository has given us an extra $15 a person for everybody who walks. Not only does it help be the people in this community, by getting people to go to this walk, you also get to build a relationship with everyone else. You get to know your neighbor a little bit better. You see a whole bunch of charities just come in, all is in one group, like one great big family. Everybody is just there just to turn around and give support of the hunger walk. I do it, my whole family does. I take my four kids and my husband too. You can do it. You are almost there. What would my world be like without the food depository? I think it would crash. Uh, because of the great numbers we serve, up to 375 to 400 families a week. So knowing that supply is there from the depository, we could pick up 8,000 pounds of food, and if we have a lot of folks coming, all of that food is gone by the end of the day. I can see um, where, where the food goes. I know it's being coming to a good cause. Even if it's a little grain of rice that I might be providing, it's, it's providing help in this community. You know, if you see somebody in trouble, at least help that person. And that's why I'm still here with the hunger walk.